teleportme.com, you have multiple types of hotspots at your disposal. So first of all, we're just going to go with your basic hotspot. It's just a little icon here that is animated or depending on what you want, you can actually change up to different icons or you can actually add your own icon right here by uploading icons and it'll keep a list of your icons like you see here. So let's just select that. There we go. So you have all these options here just for your basic hotspot, all these different icon options. Now you can also switch it to the floor, which of course with this icon, it doesn't really work very well. Uh, so let's just switch that back over to this one here. So when you put it down at the bottom, it's on the floor, it looks like it's actually laying flat on the floor. Nice little feature. So there's that. And then there is also polygon. A polygon hotspot is something that you can do to take the shape of another, like for instance, if you want to, let's say, make it like this lamp here or this light fixture. So all I'm doing here is I'm just clicking on the line and it creates a new point so that you can completely customize your polygon to whatever shape you can imagine. And you know, it, it's endless what you can do with these polygons. And on this, you can simply select if you wanted to go to a pano, which of course you wouldn't highlight a light fixture to go to another pano, but you can come up here, you can make it an image, a URL, uh, a video, or an iframe. And what these are, uh, a URL is gonna open up, of course, a website. A video will open up some sort of video that, uh, that you have uh, self-hosted. And iframe will allow you to simply link a, a video or a website or something that is in with, within an iframe, an iframe embed. But for this demonstration, I'm just simply just choosing a pano. And then when you go to look at it, there you go. Now this is completely customizable in regards to uh, like the color and whatnot. Like for instance, here you see fill color. You can come up here and you can change whatever color you want. You can also change the transparency. So you can make it just a little bit off color. And then you can increase the border size so it pays more attention. So it's more attention getting and you can change the color of that as well. And as you see there, that's how it'll look. And that is how to do a polygon. Uh, one very effective way of doing a polygon is actually uh, in a doorway. So you can actually fill this in with a polygon and make that a doorway instead of using one of these links here.